welcome to Disney Makes Coloring. If you're new here, my name is Megan, and I'm so excited to be here with you today. So, um, yeah. I am trying to get caught up, which I still sound horrible, but I'm here. I have my water. I'm good. And you guys won't know, because I will cut out all the coughing and whatnot. Anyway, this is uh, one of my absolute favorite videos to film and to watch. This is my completed pages for the month of August. And you are going to be shocked. It is quite a lot less than normal. Um, yeah, it was another month. I, I think I talked to you about it already, so I'm not going to go on and on about it. So here is my month of August. And... Um, I, for these pages, for so you know, what I plan on doing is um, printing out my buddy colors, and that's what's going to go. So it ends up being like a scrapbook, but I have a very long ways to catch up on that. So um, my completed pages, my buddy colors, and all that. But what we want is this fun page here, which is my stats page. So, as you can see, I only filmed 10 videos, and for me, that is, like, not good. Normally, I film anywhere between 15 to 20 videos a month. Um, as you can see, I, yeah. I did have quite a few times where I was not well. Um, I had some mental issues, and then I have had COVID now for seven days. And I am filming this. Today's the 1st of September. So I'm not sure when you guys will see this. Um, I have quite a few I got to show you. Um, yeah, I think um, before you see this one, you will see my uh, journal set up, my plans video. And I have this one. And then I need to film my Disney, Color Disney with Make video. Which, in case you didn't know, we are doing Lilo and Stitch. Anywho, moving along. Um, <clears throat> so this video should not be as long as my normal completed pages videos. So YouTube, um, I ended the month with 3,377. So I gained 89 subscribers. Instagram, I gained 21. And a Facebook group, which I co-host with Amanda from Amanda Colors. It is called Color With Us. There is a link in the... Uh, description box below if you'd like to join us we do all kinds of fun things um we gained 88 um friends in our group for the month of august i completed are you ready i only completed 31 pages out of 19 coloring books only one untouched book that's not good no 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 i completed three hashtags 13 out of 31 pages were disney um, I had 16 buddies and 22 out of 31 pages were buddy colors. <clears throat> and then my favorite page, I think, for the month is the page in Fairies 3. I might change my mind, but we shall see. So, yeah, let's get started. I'm going to start off with PDFs. Oh, I need this. <laughs> Don't put it away. It's your notes. So I'm going to start off with PDFs here. We're going to this over here and we're gonna start with this lovely one this is um frogs and friends 2 and this is a group color along and um that is hosted by amanda and myself we pick a page out of this book each month and um the hashtag is frogs and friends color along and we just ask if you have this book that you join us in color with us. And when you post this on social media, um, if you do Instagram, we ask you to use the hashtag frogs and friends color with us and then tag myself and Amanda. But if you post it in our Facebook group, we ask that you post it in the comments um, section below. I missed the spot with the glossy accents. <laughs> I'm seeing that. But yeah, so we did the butterfly one um, for the month of August. And um, yeah, look at how fun and sparkly. I had a lot of fun um, with this one. I used my um, my Albert Doors. I didn't do any shading. I just used my Albert Doors. And then this is my 
uh, Jelly Roll Tiaras, or not Jelly Roll, Sakura Tiaras, very sparkly, and then my Jelly Roll Glaze for the black, my white paint pen for the white, and my um, glossy accents I did in the eyes. And then my Hidden Mickey is on his wing over here. In case you didn't know, I put Hidden Mickeys in all my completed pages, or at least most of them. So um, my next one I'm going to show you is this one, um, which I am not 100% proud of, but um, I wasn't having a good month, as a lot of you know, and there was a lot of detail in the background and I didn't want to do it, so I painted over it with acrylic paint. So this is with the, I think it's the folk art, the matte, it's like a, I don't know, my moss green or something like that. Anyway, um, I do a letter every month. It makes ABC color challenge this 20, um, 2024. And um, there is a group of us on Instagram and I call it the Disney's ABC group. And I pick a page that has to do with my letter each month out of that book and we all color it. And so for the letter S, we did the Simba page. <clears throat> Anyway, you're seeing mine, but I'm going to show you um, some of the friends that are in the group that participated. I'm only going to show, name the names that of people that participated this month. So the first one I'm going to show you is Steph's from Steph Butterfly Cat 82. I love them all. I really do. It made me, mine look really sad. <laughs> But, you know, we can't always be perfect, and we don't compare. No comparing. It's, no. Everybody's pictures are beautiful. Um, the next one I have to show you is Amy's uh, from Amy Colors on Instagram. Amazing. They're all amazing. Then I have Amaya's from Amaya Ostrich. Amazing again. All of them. And then I have Cindy from Cindy Peel 1. So yes, thank you, thank you ladies for coloring with me. I so appreciate it. So now I have these two and you can tell that my coloring is off this month. I, I, I can tell anyway. This is the Disney Silhouettes book and it is a project book with Jamie from Jamie's Coloring Love. And we've been picking one to two to more pages each month. We did two this month. Um, the first one we did was Pinocchio and um, I will show you hers really. Actually, I'm going to scoot mine over. Put hers here so you can see it. Um, I absolutely love how hers turned out. Uh, yeah, these are difficult. Um, if you don't have this book, um, it is very, very tiny details. Um, and it's really hard to figure out where the paint splotches are, where they end, where they start. I So I do the best I can. Anyway, it is with Ohugu alcohol markers. And we've got a lot of um, the Jelly Roll Tiara, all the different color. I have it around all the splotches. I have some gold sparkle pop everywhere. And then I have the Jelly Roll Glaze. And then um, I did some paint pen. So we've got yellow and pink on the donuts. And then my white paint pen everywhere else. And there's my hand Mickey down there. But it is very sparkly, I must admit. So there is Pinocchio. And I'm like, what is everything? Like, I pictured these right here to be those ribbon candies, you know? You know, from, he goes to that um, island, Pleasure Island. And um, then we have the, you know, the cuckoo clocks that Geppetto makes. And then we have donuts on a stick. I'm assuming that's what those are ice cream and then the rides you know most of this is all pleasure island type things except for the little things that Geppetto would have made like this little soldier guy and the horse and the 
And then you've got the little, yeah. But <clears throat> anyway, then there is Merida. And I'll just tell you right now, um, I am not happy with mine. But let me show you Jamie's, who is amazing. Amazing. So thank you so much, Jamie, for coloring with me. Okay, I used a lot of Jelly Roll glaze on this one. All the paint splatters, I used my Jelly Roll glaze. Um, it didn't turn out to be the colors that I was expecting. But... I actually think it was a different color and then I went over it with red. Anyway, it wasn't what I was thinking. I was wanting to go with more of these colors, but it didn't it, it didn't turn out. And I didn't want to color all these little, I mean, look at it, all those little things individually. So these are with um What are they with? It's soft. And it's coming off on my hand. I think it's my pan pastels. Pretty sure it is. So we got pan pastels on all those. And then we've got some alcohol marker. And then the jelly roll glaze. And then we've got my black link everywhere. And then um, my black, the black glaze is what I outlined her with. I put my hidden Mickey's down there. And gold sparkle pop. I don't know. This one was difficult for me. I had a hard time with it. I, I didn't know how to, yeah. But those are my PDFs. Not all PDFs or loose pages. Um, the next one I have for you is Nature, Color by Number um, by Art Therapy Hatchet Hero. And this is a project book with the lovely Christy from Color with Christy. And our page for, I'm gonna, actually I'm gonna show you last month, cause I did two. I didn't get to do July's, I didn't get to it. So this one was July's. So the cute little Dumbo here. And um, I do have hers, so I will show you hers here. So you can see it. Actually, I'm gonna scoot this, just kidding. What about hers over? Um, brother bear here so we are going through this book front to back um, hers looks amazing as always I um, believe this one it does not have black outline so I add that to mine but yeah and so for the month of August we did Cinderella which you guys have seen, well, are going to see for my How Many Pumpkins video. That one's coming up. So we will be doing this one, which looks like Snow White, and it looks like a deer and one of the birds. So I'm excited about this one. So this will be for September. But that is nature. Um, so thank you, Christy. Um, the next one is Family, um, Color by Number by Art Therapy Hatchet Hero. And this is a project book with the lovely Amanda from Pandora's Pack. And um, I was behind again. So, um, yes. So I do not have her pages to show you. But um, this one was July's and this one is August's. And, oh, by the way, same with the last one. I used my Thule Art paint pens. I didn't even say that. So sorry. My Thule Art paint pens. And then I outlined the black in my Arteza. It looks like this. It's glossy. And I really like that. My Arteza black paint pen. I do all my outlining with. So I'm going to have to order some new... Um, there's certain sets I need to order a new set of. I'm, my favorite set is the Earth set. I use those the most. And I'm already on my second set. But some of the colors are already, of the second set, are 
are really low or running out or gone. We need to do that. So this turning red one should be our page for September. So thank you, Amanda. And if I have it before it goes up, I will put it. But as of right now, I do not have her pages. So um, this is the last color by number. And this one is Le Grand Classique's Tomb 2. And this is a project book with the lovely Tammy. And she is at Ice Angel 19788. And I had a lot of catching up to do. Yes, I did. Well, she's done... Um, she had done up through page 18, so I was catching up. So first I did um, Abu, which is page 17. So she had already done that one. And then um, Ratatouille was for the month of July. So I will show you her Ratatouille, um, or Remy, here so you can see it. Love it, love it. Um, and I don't know if this one has the black outlines either it does it does it does but again mine's with my um tule art paint pens and mickey is on the cheese over here he's got one on his hat and then this one was for august and i will put hers so you can see it the rhinoceros is from robin hood i think I'm pretty sure it's Robin Hood. If it's not Robin Hood, then it's... Well, it's not bed knobs and broomsticks. I'm pretty sure. Does it tell us in the back? What page is it? 19. Yes. Robin Hood. And there's my, my hidden Mickey's there. But yes. Thank you, Tammy, for coloring with me. So we will be doing page 20 is here and it's another sideways one and um in my plans video while i've talked about it it's a uh, one of the gargoyles from hunchback of notre dame and we have reptiloids too this is a project book with the lovely rosa from rosa de colores on instagram um, we finished the first book together and now we're on the second book and again i was behind <laughs> So I have July's. So this one we did. And I will put hers here so you can see it. Hers are amazing, always. I always look at mine and I'm like, oh. I just straight color in these alcohol markers. It's not good paper. It's really thin paper. But um, I did washi tape though. Do you guys see that? I made some washi tape for the... Um, <clears throat> Wallpaper, and then it's just my Ohuhu alcohol markers. Yep, and then I don't know what happened to her face. Somehow the white smeared. I don't know what I did. No, I don't. And there is my hidden Mickey is on the chair arm. Then we did this one here, and I will show you Rosa's here so you can see it. Again, amazing. So here's mine, and yeah, I love the way they're dancing, and I love how his foot is like way high in the sky. I'm not really sure what kind of dance this is, but it looks like you have to be pretty flexible to do this dance, the way he's, you know. Anyway, is he going to swing his foot over their ar his arm, or? How? Yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't know what they're doing. But it's alcohol markers, my ohus, and then we've got some silver, no. It's the clear stardust. And then we've got jelly roll glaze. I did it on the tips of his shoes and on her shoes, like she's got patent leather shoes and my white paint pen. And Mickey is on her dress. And then for this month, we decided from here on out, we're gonna go front to back. Um, I have done this one a long time ago, but um, she hasn't done this one. So I'm gonna show you hers with mine. Um, like this is, I don't know, probably over a year old, mine is. So I can't even tell you what I use. I know there's stickles on it, but here's hers. Looks absolutely amazing. 
and then we did this one. Also, I will put roses here so you can see it. So, I used my Ahuhu alcohol markers and my white paint pen. Now, I did something. Now, I'm assuming this is a cigarette. Notice I colored this half of it gray. I don't know if you can see that, you know. And then I took the white paint pen and I made some dots and then I smeared it to make smoke coming out. And then I was trying to make it look like he was having some kind of an, some kind of alcohol or something. Anyway. Yep. I don't know what I was doing with the white stuff on the frogs, but I picture them to be frog monsters, whatever, reptiloids. They're reptiloids, right? Reptiloids. Yeah. So we've already done that one. So we'll be doing this one and this one for September. Then we have this lovely project book. And this project book was originally started with Amanda from Amanda Colors and I. And then we have had lots of people join us. But I am going to tell you right now that um, not too many participated this month. So um, let me get to mine. Here is the pages that we are doing. Some One of these is coming off. Sorry, I'm going to fix this. So here we go. These are the pages we did. Um, I, um, yeah. So I'm going to show you theirs before I talk to, talk to you about mine. So I'm going to show you Amanda from Amanda Colors first. Amazing. Love it, love it. And then I'm going to show you Veronica from Veronica Dunn 66. Again, amazing. But um, here's mine. So here's our little butterfly here. And I always use um, the Jelly Roll, either um, Stardust or the Sakura Tiaras on mine with the colorful butterfly. And it has gold on it because it talks about the butterfly it does have gold on it. But then I used um, Polychromos and I went with My Colorful Country Life. I think that's whose it is where she's going through all the different pencils and doing different like combos I think that's who it is if I'm wrong I'm so sorry if I'm wrong I'll put the right person across the screen but I'm pretty sure it is anyway um so I used her gold and silver and I really like how it turned out for all of my uh to make it look like metal then I also used my gold sparkle pop and I used my silver sparkle pop and some um, blue tiara and then my white paint pen. But yeah, it's, it looks good. I'm impressed. This one scares me. <laughs> it's a lot. There's even a map. We got a map and a castle and a dragon and a mouse. So thank you ladies for coloring with me and that is Ivy and the Inky Butterfly by Joanna Besford. And then I have 50 dessert themed miniatures and I did this lovely page here and I did it with all of you. And I did this one for my um, adult coloring for beginners series. This is the one we did for where to start on the page. Um, and then it also went for Yolanda from Coloring Biker Mama is, does a, she's doing a Camellia Angel Coba prompt each week. And for the week I did this, it was ice cream. So there's that. I really like how it turned out. I'm going to be honest with you, when I first started saw this I thought it was two hippos and I was going to color them the same color 
And then I realized it was a hippo and then a, and a rhinoceros. Didn't. But I like how it turned out. It's really cute. Um, we used uh, my Ohuhu markers and Prismacolors over the top and my um, Sakura tiaras on the sprinkles. And then we've got Jelly Roll Glaze on the chocolate chips. That's what I'm saying it as. And then... Um, I did. I thought I did a hidden Mickey. Oh, it's on the cherry. It also goes for my ABC challenge for strawberry ice cream and um, sprinkles. And yeah, here we go. I need to take. A, I need a drink. <clears throat> so I think that was it. Yeah. And the hashtag, her hashtag was, um, it's Camellia Angel Cova Prompts 2024. But yes, this next one is Art Deco by Art Therapy Hatchet Hero. And I did two. And both of them were um, for the scavenger hunt in my Facebook group. We do weekly scavenger hunts where we have a Disney character and, and then a general prompt. So a Disney prompt and a general prompt. So one of them was Hercules. So here is my lovely Hercules. And Megara, I think her name is. Meg, Megara. And um, I used my Neo Color 2s. So this was Neo Color 2s with Prisma Colors over the top. My white paint pen. And then some of the black here is uh, my Tombow, my black Tombow. And then here is my hidden Mickey. I don't know if you can see it. And that's obviously my gold sparkle pop. And then I also did, I don't know why that's on there. Now it's got a lovely sticky residue. I did Peter Pan. This was another one of our Disney prompts in the Facebook group for August. I didn't give, I didn't do it anymore. I didn't really color very much at all. There's my hidden Mickey. Um, this one is with my Neo Color 2s also. No, it's not. Okay, I did not tell the truth. This is Neo Color 2's. This is my Albert Doors and my Polychromos. So this is my Neo Color 2's and then we've got um, my Prismas and then the gold is my Sparkle Pop. Um, and then we've got, I colored this in this is black Tombow, just that one spot. And I think this two around. But yeah, my white paint pen. So that is Art Deco. Next one we have is Romantic Country, The First Tale. And this is a full book color along we are doing here on the channel. We are coloring this together and we did this page. <clears throat> this month. Do you see this? My book is going to fall apart. Yikes. So if it comes unbound, I might have to take it and get it like spiraled or something. Anyway, so we did this one together and I really love how the sky turned out. I really, really do. Um, we used our Neo Color 2s. Um, on the sky. And then the rest of it was Prisma Colors. And then we used um, the Gold Sparkle Pop and my white paint pen. My head Mickey is in the water over here. Um, in case you didn't watch my plans video, we are choosing either this one This one, or this, can you even see this one? <laughs> I 
not showing it to you. This one here. Or where'd it go? This one. This kitchen one. So yeah, I'll be putting up a poll. Alright. More some more buddy colors. This is Enchanted Faces by Hannah Lynn. And this is my project book with Amanda from Amanda Colors. So we do three pages each month out of this book. So here is the first one, and I will put Amanda's here so you can see it. I'll bring mine up closer so hers is big, as you can see it. Absolutely beautiful. I love hers always, always, always. So um, I went with a pink and yellow theme here. So she's got pink and blonde hair and um with the like a hibiscus flowers in her hair i missed a, there's some white spot up there and i think it's supposed to be hair but i don't know and then i didn't know what this was right here I was not sure um so i just made it pink i'm gonna hit mickey's there and i always put washi tape around it and then we did this one was an experiment I will put um, Amanda's here so you can see hers. Really like how she did hers. I think she did a totally different kind of a skin tone. I was trying to do a darker skin tone and I tried to do something around the eyes here. I don't know, I don't like how it turned out. Nope, 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 I didn't tell you what I used. Wow, my brain, it's, you know, it happens. It says my Prisma colors and my uh, Sakura tiaras in my link and my white paint pen. My link is the black. So where did we go? So here we have um, the purple uh, tiaras. And then the clear stardust on some of the silver. She's got purple in her hair. I like how the flowers turned out though. The purple and the cream. And then we did this one, which I absolutely love. I will show you Amanda's here so you can see it. Love it, love it. So, I tried to give, I wanted to do glittery hair on each one, so I did pink, purple, and now this one is red. So again, it's my Prismacolors and then my tiara, my red tiara, my black link, and her eyelashes. I gave her a hidden Mickey tattoo. She's got heart tattoos too. But yeah, we are doing this one. This one and this one for September. Those are a nice, fun, quick color for me. Next one I have is Beyond Fairy Tales by Eerie. And this is a project book with Jess from Coloring Bumblebee. Now I do not have Jess's page at this moment, but if I have it by the time I edit and post it, I will <clears throat> show it to you. And we did this one, which I don't think this is actually Thumbelina. I know this is Thumbelina, but I don't think this one is, but because they are, I need, I need to translate them all. They are all translated in the front, which I guess they could all be, I don't know. But it, see, it says one, two, one, two, one, two. So I guess it is Thumbelina. So um, this is um, Giacomo, the sparrow, that tries to help her. And so I based his colors off of the Giacomo in the cartoon. And, yeah. So I, uh, what did I use? My prisma colors. 
there's prismic colors, there's jelly roll glaze in the stained glass windows on the chain here and there. And we got white paint pen and we've got some purple, need some purple sparkly shoes in here. Um, I believe it's my link. And then I got, um, I had Mickey on the blanket there. Yeah, he gets a thorn in his wing and she helps him. So that is Beyond Fairy Tale by Eerie. We have Giant Book. This is Vitro Trim 1. This is a project book with um, two friends. My friend Claire from uh, Claire Colors 1986 and Sophie from Sophie's Coloring Journey. And we did Scrooge. And here is my Scrooge. And he doesn't want to fit all the way in the page. In the, let me zoom that out. Well, you don't see my jammies. Here we go. So there he is. I do not have their pages um, as of right this moment. If I have them before I um, post this, I will share them with you. Anyway, um, I had fun with this. I had a hard time figuring out, though, what was what. But I was thinking money, because Scrooge was all about money. So I was thinking dollars are green, coins are gold. So I went with green and gold. And then these are his colors. I looked him up on Pinterest. There was only one coin, so I did that one with my Sparkle Pop. Otherwise, the rest of this, I did it all with... My Albert Dewar's first, and went over the top with my Polychromos. I'm trying to get better at my uh, watercolor pencils. And then my hidden Mickey is right here in the corner. But I really like how this one turned out. I like it a lot. Now, this might be my second runner-up for this month. And then we are doing this page for September. We're doing... Alice, because we always pick a page that has to do with my letter, ABC. But that is Vitro, my art therapy hatchet hero. Then we have, we will zoom us back in. Whoa, too far. This is Color Me Capybaras um, by Ella Jarzbeck. And I had two separate buddy colors in here. I can take this off. So satisfying when you get to take off the washi tape. This is my one and only untouched coloring book that I colored in. Sad, right? Sad. I had a whole bunch. Now they're all set up for September. I got a lot to color. So, um, a first one um, I did it was a buddy color with the wonderful sisters, Dana and Amy. Um, Dana from Dana's Coloring Obsession and Amy from Amy Colors. And I am going to show you uh, both of theirs here. Uh, love them both. They kind of both turned out a little bit similar. Love it. Love it, love it. Thank you ladies so much for coloring with me. Um, I actually really enjoyed coloring in this book. Um, yeah. So... I wanted to do that sky again, like I did in my um, romantic country. So I tried really hard, um, but this time I used my Albert Doors. So it's my Albert Doors and my Polychromos. And yeah, I really like it. I've got some. Um, stardust over here with blue and I tried to make it like have you guys seen the rainbow fish story there's a story and he gives away some of his rainbow scales it's a cute story but that's what I was thinking of when I saw this fish but yeah this is my husband we're gonna name him Aaron my husband's name is Aaron so here's Aaron fishing in a boat so we don't have a boat and he really doesn't fish in a boat so that's more like my grandpa um, but 
He, he fishes more off, of, off the shore. But yes, so again, thank you ladies for coloring with me. Then I did this one, which I absolutely love. And this one is a buddy color with the, um, her Instagram is color.sam. So I'm assuming her name is Sam. If that is wrong, let me know. Um, but yeah, and we are doing another one in September out of here. Um, so, I, like I said, this book I'd never colored in, so I was experimenting. So, I used alcohol markers, which performed beautifully on this paper. It is thirsty paper, though. So, um, yeah, it used up a lot of marker. And then I, um, did I show you hers? Let me show you hers. Hers is amazing. And I mean amazing. The way she made her wood look and their fur, yeah. So, yeah. So thank you, thank you for coloring with me. And yeah, so again, it's my oh who's with over the uh, Prisma colors over the top. And what else? My white paint pen. Yep. Yep, yep. I want them to match because they're square dancing. You know, like those couples that square dance. But co color.sam and I are doing this one for September. Like how, look at how many pumpkins that would be. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 pumpkins. You guys are going to die when you see how many pumpkins I've colored. It's ridiculous. <laughs> ridiculous. Okay. I didn't tell the truth. So, Scrooge would be number three. This would be number one. Fairies would be number two. And my favorites this month. So this is 50 Farmers Miniatures. Um, and I am coloring in this book with Erica from Elm Colors every month. And we have been having so much fun, and we both have been getting more and more creative with the pages. Now, last one we did was this one, which I absolutely love, and we did something very similar. Hers was um, similar to this, and I absolutely love it. Mine was a wanted. Hers wasn't wanted, though. Hers was something. Rootin' tootin' something or other. So, are you guys ready? As I love it. Look at this. Look at it. So I came up with this idea and she messaged me and um, said, I'm drawing a blank. And I don't believe either one of us finished it in July. I think this was actually July and August page. And she's like, I don't know what to do with it. And I said, well, I was thinking a kissing booth, like at the fair, a carnival, a kissing booth. And she was well, just like, yes. So let me show you her kissing booth, which is, blows me away, of course. I mean, it's Erica, so, yeah. Amazing, amazing, amazing. But I really, really like how they both turned out. So you guys know, all that's here is the fence, the two pigs, and the corn stalks. So I created the wood going further up and the sign. And then the hearts, um, I did, that actually is a, um, what are they called? <laughs> Still, uh, stencil. Um, and then the lips aren't the best, so don't look at those. Those I just freehanded. And same with my lettering. So, uh, yeah. But yeah, thank you, Erica. That is so much, so much fun. I am so enjoying doing these and you make me totally think outside the box and I just love it. Um, I used on mine um, my Ohus to do the basing and then I went over it with my Prismacolors. Hold on. And then um, it says I used some Does I use Thule Art paint pen, but I don't know where. 
I don't know what I was thinking. But I also um, used my Micron. That's the black. And I think it's the hearts. I think the hearts are the paint pen. And because I drew that in after I had colored with the marker and the pencil, I wanted it to show up. So yeah, so the hearts and the dots are the Tule art. Hold on. I don't know about you, but when you get a cough, does yours get worse at night? Because mine does. <clears throat> like it's like out of control. And then I have the hardest time sleeping. And then I end up sleeping all day because I don't sleep at night because I'm coughing my head off. It's ridiculous. Anyway. So we are doing... Um, So I want to come up with an idea. I had so much fun with the other one of what we could do. We're doing this one. So, I mean, I don't know what we could do to it, but I'm gonna ask her if she has any ideas because I don't of what we could add to this. Other, The only idea I have is just bordering it in, adding a border. But I don't know. So that's 50 Farmers Miniatures. So thank you, Erica, so very, very much. So here would be number two, and this is Fairies 3 by Christine Karen. This is Project Book with my lovely friend, Ilvin, from Ilvin's <coughs> Coloring, and um, we did this one. And um, let me show you Ilvin's here. absolutely beautiful I love it now <clears throat> thank you Ilvin so much for coloring with me so this is just my Prismacolors and I colored it all with one layer and then I went over the wings with my white Prisma and I really like the way it looked a lot um, I really want to and I need to is go over the lines with my white paint pen and I think they would stand out even more. I need to do that. I didn't use any paint pen in this. And then the purple is my um, Sakura Tiara. But I love the way the tears turned out. I'm really enjoying this book a lot. Um, so we're doing this one for September. Um, yeah. I'm hoping we can do another one, but I don't have any more of the fairies ones. That's the only fairies book I have. Then we got 50 Prehistoric Miniatures. This is a project book with my friend Steph from Steph Louise Argyle on Instagram. She is completing this book and is almost done. So I'm helping her finish it. So it won't be complete by the time she's finished with hers because I think she only has like 16 pages left or something or I got a lot more than that <laughs> but I really enjoy the page that we did this um for August we did the was it what they saber tooth tigers or something like that so I'm gonna put Steph's here so you can see hers so cute and I enjoy I had fun um they're a little darker than I wanted them to be, but, you know, let me just tell you, there is not a really good light orange in the Ohuhu marker set. Um, like, it needs to be, I can't explain the color. Nobody really has it. It's like um, a really light, like orange with a lot of white in it like really light orange because yeah but anyway it's my ho ho alcohol markers and then prisma colors over the top and then we've got for my butterfly i used my um glaze my jelly roll glaze i've got orange red and purple yeah it didn't really go together very well but that's okay and then um my white paint pen I was like, I don't have a hand Mickey. It's right there. But thank you, Steph, for coloring with me. And then last but not least is Nice Little Town 6. 
and um yeah this book I've actually completed the book but I'm only going to show you one page um, but I did finish the other page but I've been saving that one for September but here is August page and this is a project book with my friend Brandy from Colors by Brandy I will put hers here so you can see it absolutely love it so thank you Brandy now, as you all know, I don't really like, care for coloring food, but I did have fun. I decided I'm going to stick with a very small color palette, which was this, this color and the pink and the blue. I guess this would be light orange. I should use that color. I wonder what color that is. Anyway, um... It goes with my ABC challenge for strawberry, strawberry ice cream, strawberry icing. Um, you got stems, the flower stems. It's a store. It's a bakery, but it is a store, right? So, um, I just based it with my Ohuhu alcohol markers and then went over it with my Prismacolors. We've got some sparkle pop. We have some jelly roll glaze on the strawberries, the seeds. We've got stardust or tiara, I'm not sure which it is. And sparkle pop. Again, so you can see all the fun sparkles. One more page in this book. I'm, and I finished mine, so. Hey, it's a complete book. I'm so excited. So I'm just gonna leave it so you can see it a couple of these here so I didn't get to half of my buddies this um, month let me let me tell you so um, I didn't do I didn't get to my mini mania but Zoe and I both agreed that we were moving it um, she didn't get to hers either um, my broken circles too um, I uh, Jenny was on a vacation so I need to reach out to her and see if we're still coloring in the book or not. And then um, Lost and Found by RJ Hampson is with my friend Claire, Claire Colors. Um, she finished hers, but I did not finish mine, so I got to work on that one. And then um, Candace from Happy Catastrophe and uh, Veronica, Veronica Dunn 66 and I are, were doing the Otter page in Wild Summer. They both finished theirs. I did not finish mine. D from Dusty Coloring um, and Veronica, Veronica Dunn, <clears throat> 66. Um, we were doing one in Funny Tales by Kevin Tail Art, the Snow White page. They both finished theirs. I did not finish mine. Susie from A Sue Bear Wolves. Um, it was 50 Woodland Minis. We were doing the Mushroom Faces. Um, she finished hers and I did not finish mine. But I kind of, when I, I explained to doing the buddy colors, I was doing them August, September. And everybody has been amazing and totally understanding. We've got um, Kate from Koo's Life in Color. Um, we did Matchstick Mouse Big Adventure um, with the Chipmunk page. She finished hers. I did not do mine. Um, Shelly from Shell's Coloring Journey. We've had a page that we've been supposedly working on all summer. I haven't touched mine. And I'm going to get it done in September. Um, and that is the Dr. Doolittle page in Erie's World, I said Erie's World Literature. And then Brittany from Color Through It, her and I are doing a stitch page out of the 100% stitch. We It was for July and neither one of us got it done, um, but we both decided to save it for Space Timber. And then um, I have the Eerie Dragon book with the boy and the sea lion with at H Rise. Um, neither one of us got ours done. So that one I'm, we moved to September. And then Jamie from Jamie's Coloring Love and I um, were supposed to do a page out of Nice Little Town 12. I don't know if we ever picked one out, but it didn't happen. And then the ice cream page from the um, Desert Fox books. But we've now switched the page. And then Steph from Steph Butterfly Cat 82. We had two pages. Um, we had one out of uh, Summer Mandalas. 
and one out of the uh, Magical Chibis by Alexander Francis. She finished that one, um, and I did not finish either one. And I think that's it. I wrote them. I moved them all over here. Oh, Julianne from Julianne and at Art. We were supposed to do the Annie Day Picking Berries page. She got hers done. <laughs> I did not. And Christy from Color with Christy. Um, Around the World by uh, R.J. Hampson. We were supposed to do the Frog with the Turtle page. I did not get mine done. I don't think she got... I don't remember if she got hers done or not. Um, I think that was it that I missed. Nope. Joe. Jerry Col Colors was the other one. From Small Dolls by Art Therapy Hatchet Hero. And um, we were supposed... To to do the Sleeping Beauty page. She got hers done. And I did not. <laughs> Such a good buddy. I feel really, really bad, actually. I'm so sorry. I really hope you all understand. Um, my plan for the month of September is to color my little heart out. Um, my goal, I actually have some goals. Number one is to have more energy. Um, do more things um, instead of sleeping all the time which is I know that's part of being ill and um the mental thing but I need to not um I want to cook more I want to experiment with recipes I want to color more and I want to get more on top of my videos to get better I want to post more on Instagram and in my Facebook group because I don't ever post anything in anywhere and I feel really bad it needs to be like I feel like I, what I need to do is I need to plan out my day every day. I need to do that. And I think if I write it down and hold myself accountable, I will do better. What do you guys think? What do you think? So I have my coloring planner. But I think what I want to do is like, uh, I don't want to have another planner though. I don't know. I don't like having multiple planners, but I need to have it to where I write out my day. Now, I think I have a notepad. I need to find it that has like Monday through everything uh, a week. And then I can just make a list. I need to find that. If I find that, I'll show it to you. I will put a picture of it right here so you can see what I'm talking about. Anywho, I got some... Um, some happy mail today not uh, from myself so excited i'm gonna give you a sneak peek you ready sneak peek uh -uh. <laughs> i'm so excited and i'm not really i wasn't her fan but i love it and the book is thick i didn't realize how many pages it has now it's thicker than a hannah carlson book and a marie Chulley book it is amazing and great paper um I really want to get the new Hannah Carlson book is out, but I looked that up and in order to get it here in the United States, you have to get it on imusic.co and with basic shipping, the book is $20 and then basic six shipping, it was $11 and something. So it was going to be over $30 for one coloring book where if I wait and get it on Amazon US, but I think I have to wait a whole year. It'll be a lot less than that. So I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. So it's not in my sad day. It's not on my in my list to buy purchase at the moment. But I'm so far looking forward to the books that are coming out this month. Um, we should be getting two Morgan O'Brien Annie Day books. There should be a Karen Myers new fall book. Um, there is a color, some Disney books that are coming out that I'm excited about. One of them is um, it's one with all the heroes. It's a heroes color by number, so it's all the Disney guys. Um, and then there was another forget. I'm talking off the top of my head, so I can't remember. 
anyway that's everything um i hope you enjoyed it sorry about the glare i need to give you a coloring book that doesn't have a glare do i have one yes i do ah, there you go and you've been staring at the glare for the whole time um yeah if you're new and you made it through thank you so much um don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you can join our lovely family. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button and you like it. Comment down below what page was your favorite um, if you made all the two. Which page did you like? Do you agree with me? Um, I think the kissing booth one is my favorite. And then the fairies one. And then the Scrooge one. But, yeah. So, yeah. Um, I want you to know how much I appreciate you all. I love you all. And I so enjoyed making these videos, talking to all of you. And I look forward to talking to you all real soon.